Hey guys, so I'm back and I'm gonna show you how I contour and highlight with my cream concealer. So the first thing I did was, of course, just apply my foundation and I'm gonna apply it with my hands because, I don't know, I'm a little sick of applying foundation with brushes. So now I'm gonna use these color corrective concealers from Shea Moisture and I'm gonna use the lightest color um, on my nose, the bridge of my nose, on um, the center of my forehead, um, my cheek on top of my cheekbones underneath my eyes of course to conceal the dark circles as well And you can find these at Target and now I'm gonna take the darkest color And this is where I chisel my face and I'm gonna put it on my temples um, The side of my nose to make it a little thinner and slender Oh man, the things we do with makeup. <laughs> I'm gonna put it underneath my lip um, just to create a shadow underneath my lip to make it look a little fuller because my top lip is bigger than my bottom lip. So that's why I do that. <laughs> I'm gonna put it um, in my cheekbones and on my jawline because my face is getting a little chubs. Y'all might not see it, but I've been, I've been eating a lot. No, I'm not pregnant because I know that question's gonna be asked. <laughs> I've just been eating a lot, so it's really time to chisel this jawline because it's practically non-existent now. So after I'm done with that, and um, you can just do this with your fingers, yeah, so you don't have to use a brush to apply the concealer. I'm gonna take this stipple brush, and I love this brush. Like, I wanted to use another brush that was a little cheaper and more affordable but like guys seriously this this brush if you guys have one out there that's cheaper let me know but this brush um it just works the best for me so i just use a stipple brush and blend everything in and first i start with the lighter color and just blend 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 in circular motions and this brush really just works magic and then um, I'm gonna go over the darker areas with the darker concealer and blend that in as well. I'm just gonna blend this out and I'm gonna try to stay within the area that I want the dark contour to be. Because if you start just going crazy and blending your whole face together then it just disappears and then what you just did was pointless and a waste of time. Always in my hairline, I always get makeup on my hair. That's nothing new. And now I'm just gonna blend out the contour on my nose. And this I'm just gonna go all over because I really don't like, I hate when harsh lines are visible for your nose contour. I just think it looks cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs. So now I'm gonna take this bronzer and this fan brush and I'm gonna go over the contour that I did with the concealer. Um, I just use a little bit. I don't want it to look crazy. I don't really like super crazy contours because with my face, I just feel like it just doesn't look good. No bueno. And I'm just gonna take that on the areas that I concealed with the darker concealer and go over it. And it also sets the concealer so that it doesn't move and you know especially for those of you out there like me who have super oily skin and I also like to contour um, my eyeballs in the crease just to give it some depth and now I'm gonna take this powder right here and highlight but I don't highlight too crazy I like to keep it just about like a shade or a shade and a half lighter than my skin tone this is more of like a natural not so dramatic contour and I just put those in the areas that I put the lighter concealer my nose underneath my eyes my cheekbones the center of my forehead on top of my lip um, and then I'm just gonna clean up the contour that I did with the concealer and the bronzer or the contour powder just to make it stand out more and now I'm gonna take this big fluffy brush and some setting power HD set power HD setting powder and I'm gonna set my face and this is just gonna make everything look flawless poreless seamless fearless fierceness <laughs> and then that is it this is how I contour and highlight with cream concealer and now I'm gonna go and put the rest of my face on for you guys so you can just see how it looks with a finished look and this is how it looks I hope you guys enjoy it. I love you guys. Please comment below. Let me know if you enjoyed this video and thumbs up. And I'll see you in my next video. Deuces.
Hold up, it's my 